is going to be very problematic. This, when we started, this is not an antagonizing space. And so what you're trying to do is collapse this space and make it antagonizing, which we will not allow. This is a progressive space for people to say their opinions. And we have noted how those opinions are going to be laid out. So I would like you to first apologize and then go on and agree to abiding by the rules of the space. Otherwise, I'd lo I'll, I would, if you're not willing to do that, I'd please ask you to remove yourself from the space. But th those are the rules of engagement of the space. Okay, I'm very sorry to the time. Okay, and you agree to abide by the rules of the space. Thank you. Please carry on. So I will finish. See, that very response is the reason why I am not in the science faculty. I did science throughout my high school years, and there was a lot of things that I just, um, yeah, but it's fine. But Western modernity is the direct antagonistic factor to decolonization because Western knowledge is totalizing. It is saying that it was Newton and only Newton who knew or saw an apple falling and then out of nowhere decided that gravity existed and created a, an equation and that is it. For the re whether people knew Newton or not or whether whatever happens in Western Africa, Northern Africa, the thing is the only way to explain gravity is through Newton who sat under a tree and saw an apple fall. So Western modernity is the problem that decolonization directly deals with. 